Welcome back to China Price Watch. In today's Money Matters, we're talking about the impact of pollution on the Chinese economy. The government's policy on curbing coal usage can help alleviate the country's pollution issue. But if that's not enough, China's economic growth rate has shrunk for the past two years. This increases the pressure for solving the country's pollution dilemma. The Asian Development Bank, in association with Tsinghua University, published a report indicating the financial losses caused by air pollution. It shows that the total losses from pollution account for 1.2 percent of China's GDP each year. It gave a more concrete example. Let's refer to the severe air pollution earlier this year. During a six-day period of heavy pollution, the city of Sijiazhuang shut down over 2,000 companies and nearly 150 mines. Total financial losses of that city reached 6 billion yuan, or about 1 billion U.S. dollars. So the question is, how much of the country's GDP growth would decrease if the government decided to solve the air pollution crisis? Many experts said it's difficult to evaluate it so far, but they do admit it would negatively affect China's economy in the future. The chief economist of industrial bank Lu Zhengwei warns the aggravating air pollution could speed up the country's loss of laborers. Lu attributes China's economic boom over the past three decades as a consequence of the country's large scale of demographic dividends. But now the heavy air pollution has caused more residents to get cancer. The increasing terminal cancer rate makes economists worry the country's high economic growth rate would end soon. Both central and local governments have already invested money to solve the issue. As Finance.Sina.com reports, the city of Qingdao announced it will invest $75 million to curb the smog. The city of Wuhan will also invest $4.5 billion over the next four years. The Beijing municipal government even announced it plans to provide $123 billion to improve air quality. The central government also plans to raise $290 billion from state-owned and private companies to solve the issue. The total amount is also equal to Beijing's GDP in 2013. The investment is huge, but both experts and a number of government officials believe it would bring more benefit than cost. It is predicted investing in curbing air pollution bring $320 billion of revenue from the environmental protection industry. It is also predicted that will help create nearly 2.5 million jobs for Chinese citizens. Some economists worry the government fighting air pollution would damage the country's economy. However, with the right legislation and investment, these protective measures would draw the economy back on track. Don't go away, because up next for a question of the day, Lu Beijinger's thoughts on the coal industry. Stay tuned.